Welcome again to another video. In this video, we'll be creating stem and leaves display and histogram using SPSS 26. For this video, prepare the following data, which contains values for age of male and female. I'm going to go and create stem and leaves for one of the variables. So to start, we go to Analyze and Descriptive Statistics. We choose Explore. Let's create the stem and leaf for female. So put it over here. Make sure you choose if you want the statistics, plots, or both. In this case, I want only the plots. We go over here and make sure the stem and leaf is displayed. And the box plot, choose none, unless you want the box plot. And of course, if you want histogram, you can choose from here. Click continue. And you will see that you will have the stem and leaf display over here. So you will have that frequencies on the left, the stem and the leaf. So we have two 24s. We have 325, 26, 27, 29, and so on. Let's go back to the data set. And let's repeat the same thing for the male. So we're going to remove the female. And we're going to add the male. We'll just make sure that I have a and leaf. And what's on me. Click OK, and this is the standard lead for the mail. Same idea, we have the frequencies, stems, and the ones. Now, let's go back to the data set and just show you quickly. Repeat that so you go to analyze, descriptive statistics, explore. Choose the variable, make sure you pick what you want to display, click on plots, make sure you have the stem and leaf checked, the other is unchecked unless you want them, continue, click OK, and you will have the result. Let's now do a frequency distribution and histogram for the data set, and we're going to do it also for both, so we're going to go browser to analyze. Descriptive statistics, but this time we're going to go to frequencies. Since the male is already there, then we're going to do it for the male. Let's click on charts and make sure you choose the histogram. And if you want the normal curve on the histogram, you can check that. You see that you can do a bar and bar chart here, but we're interested in the histogram. So let's click continue, click on statistics. You can choose any of the statistics if you want them. Let's click on these two to check the degree of skewness of the histogram. And make sure you check display frequency tables. Click OK. And here we have summary of the data. You can see the skewness is 0 0.618. And we have frequency histogram distribution based on the data. And down below, we have the histogram. And this is the normal curve to show you that the data is left normal, screwed to the right, and so on. Let's see the email. So we're going to go back to analyze. Descriptive statistics, frequencies, we're going to remove the male and add the female. Click OK. 
it gives us the email and you can see that the sequence is a little bit slower or it's smaller than the mail it's 0.52 and this is the histogram for it but the same idea and as we did with the bar chart and the pie chart you can double click here it opens the chart and you can change the colors of the bars you can change any properties that you want similar to what we did with the pie and bar chart so one more time let's see how we can do this analyze descriptive statistics frequencies you add the variable that you want click on charts make sure histogram is selected if you want any of the summary statistics click here and pick whatever you want once you're done click ok and you will have the histogram ready so in this video we did a histogram and stand on leave thank you for watching don't forget to subscribe and let's look for other videos on how to use SPSS.